Today we're doing a video on September 24th, 2013, on a Tuesday. And we're doing solar panel, which has a battery inside of it. And this is by Green Concept. I got this at uh, at Menards. I think it was like 20 bucks. Charge it on a little micro here, and then use the USB to plug it into devices, whatever. But that's not work here. You have to press the button, by the way, for it to work. Didn't they didn't say that in the instructions? But that's not what we're here for. We're here for this device here. It is the EZP 2010. It is a USB high-speed programmer for an 8-pin uh, chip that you have for BIOS. This is a BIOS chip right here. And it has a select amount of different types of chips you can use. Okay, I had to label it in red because it gets confusing. So the bottom one, they are the master, and it says copy with arrow up, is the blank one that you want. So the one I got from my device, which is from an Acer, had a little red little red dot here. I don't know if you can see it. Probably not. So I'm gonna put that as the master right there. So it moves around. The moon is facing that direction, which is north. Same way with the blank one. They sell those blank. And then all I do is push this thing down and it will start the power and run light will come on. So before I hit that to come down, start it. I'm gonna plug this in. To here, to the Easy P twenty ten, into the solar panel, even though <laughs> this is gonna do this out in the sun, right? So to turn it on, you gotta hit this button, like so. It comes on. This light comes on. You lock this thing down, like so. You see the little green light? And you gotta keep pressing this button here, otherwise it shuts it down because it's a circuit in the solar panel thing. So it writes on the run, and when the green light goes off, it is done programming. Let's see if I can get this up. There. Then it's done. That was it. It programmed the the blank chip already for the master. Huh. Wow. That took like thirty seconds to do. And that's my video. See ya.